Note the rectangular bruising around these wounds, mm -hmm. here and here, mm -hmm. caused by the hilt of the knife, striking with force enough to compress the skin. And as a result, the injuries penetrate deeper than the actual length of the blade. He's also honed the blade so fine, it's brittle enough for bits to break when it strikes bone, which is why slivers of blade were found inside both of his victims. We now know those slivers come from the same murder weapon. Wait, two victims? How many people has he killed? Five that we know of. So we're looking at a serial? Well, yes and no. We believe we're dealing with a professional. Someone with extensive military training. A contract killer? I used tomographic reconstruction of Kunin's wounds to generate a 3D model of the blade used. It's a special operations group knife. The kind favored by special forces in Gulf War I. He kills with a single blow using these other wounds to camouflage the skill with which the initial stroke was delivered. The very same method and the very same weapon that the killer employed ten years ago. Laney, I'm so sorry. Detective Beckett, there is no doubt in my mind Jack Coonan was killed by the same man who murdered your mother.